I'm planning on moving out of the man cave here to this building back here once I build an add-on to it uh, for a little bit more space and a little bit better uh, insulation from the elements because as everyone knows trailers suck um, and I'm getting older like everybody and anybody who has lived off the grid uh, needed with wood will tell you this is a lot of work and uh, you know that wood doesn't cut and stack itself it doesn't take itself indoors and put it in the fireplace or any of that stuff so um, I'm working on automating some things uh, partly for that you know tell me how the wood stove is doing and stuff like that and also because this puppy my fuser We've made a breakthrough and it has become dangerous to be in the room while it's running. So, we are working on a LAN of things, thinking that a uh, Internet of Things is a very stupid idea. And um, let's see, what do we have here? Here's an Arduino I'm currently testing. You might see the little light going on and off. That's because it's being commanded by this Raspberry Pi. Uh, running this protocol that, uh, yes, I developed for the Arduino on the Pi. It's kind of fun. Uh, there's some of the messages flying around. And in fact, if I go there, let's see. Oh, got to grab the right mouse. I got too many computers. Um, we can film the Pi filming me. <laughs> Um, while it's doing all of this other stuff, it's running Apache and MySQL and uh, a version of this protocol I just designed, which is what this movie is really going to, or I mean the uh, resulting web post on my board is, is going to be about. But this is also sort of a dry run for um, uh, remoting the fuser from over there because, um, you know, a lot of the same software is going to apply. And uh, even though I have all these wonderful displays and all this crap here, uh, it's actually pretty simple to run this thing. And we're burying some cable, both Cat6 and good old telephone wire. Because there's some things you don't trust to a computer, like the master off switch. What if it crashes? So, for those of you who think I must have died or gotten sick, no, I've just been busy writing software and testing it. Uh, have a good one.